Another legal setback for the Trump administration after a federal judge blocks the president's executive order to withhold funds from sanctuary cities. It's the latest blow to the president's agenda on illegal immigration in the short term. Claudia Cowan joins us live from San Francisco with more. Claudia? Yeah, from City Hall, Jenna, where you could almost hear the sigh of relief yesterday. Now, this ruling affects not just San Francisco and Santa Clara, the two counties that filed this lawsuit, but hundreds of these so-called sanctuary cities that can now plan their budgets, knowing that they will get the federal funding they were counting on, no strings attached, at least for now. The court sided with us on every substantive issue. I hope this president president learns from his litany of mistakes. His first 100 days have been a disaster. But I hope for all of our sakes that he can turn it around. The lawsuit was filed just blocks from where Bay Area resident Kate Steinle was fatally shot in 2015 by a repeat felon and five-time deportee who was supposed to have been turned over to federal immigration agents, but who was shielded by the city's sanctuary policy. The case shocked the nation and became a campaign talking point for Donald Trump, who signed an executive order in January to withhold federal funds from cities that harbor illegal immigrants. Lashing out on Twitter this morning, President Trump called yesterday's ruling ridiculous, adding, quote, see you in the Supreme Court. He also attacked the federal judge who issued the injunction, and today William Oreck is coming under scrutiny. Barack Obama nominated him in 2012 after Oreck reportedly raised more than $200,000 for Obama's 2008 presidential campaign. In a statement reacting to yesterday's ruling, the White House vowed to, quote, pursue all legal remedies to the sanctuary city threat, and we are still waiting to hear if that means challenging this nationwide injunction at the Ninth Circuit Court of Appeals, also based around the corner here in San Francisco. Jenna? Claudia, thank you.